Hello guys, welcome to my channel Digitech Keys. Now in this video, I will tell you how to draw transition table, state transition table by using state transition diagram. So this is the state transition diagram. I am taking it as an example and I will tell you how to draw this one. So guys, before starting, please like and subscribe my channel. Okay, so this is the values inside this okay this is a brief introduction about the diagram the values inside this circle is these two values 0 0 means this 0 0 is your present state 0 1 is your present state 1 1 is your present state and 1 0 is your present state okay now these arrows these arrows you can you can you are able to see many arrows in this diagram okay so each present state is having two outgoing arrows okay it can have many incoming arrows but uh, it is uh, each present state will have two outgoing arrows one for zero input and one is for one input okay so you can see zero zero is having this arrow and this arrow so here this zero by zero this first zero is representing input okay this is your input value and this second zero is representing your output value present state 0 0 is for this arrow okay for this arrow I am taking this arrow 0 0 oblique 0 0 so this 0 0 is reaching because this arrow is good starting from uh, the same state and reaching to the same state it means no transition is taking place when the input is 0 so here you can see present state I have taken 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 I have taken all the inputs present states now we are going to find the next state okay when the input is 0 and when the input is 1 what will be the output value for input 0 and for input 1 so 0 0 for 0 input the first 0 is 0 input the 0 uh, this arrow is again reaching to a 0 0 value okay so the for 0 the next state will be next state will be let me uh, put the value for the next state so for because no transition is taking place for 0 0 so for input you can see the input is 0 here so 0 0 is giving you next state is 0 0 when the input is 0 now you see what will what is your output so output is 0 so just put output 0 here now come to this second arrow 1 0 okay 1 0 now your input value is 1 first first value is 1 so input value is 1 so it is reaching to the next state is 0 1 let's go to the 0 1 okay and the output is 0 this is the 0 so output is 0 when your input is 1 the output is 0 now come to the next state the next state is 0 1 okay means the present state now we are taking 0 1 present state okay again when when the input is 1 this is 1 okay this one is here when input is 1 it is again going to the 0 1 it means no transition is taking place for input 1 okay so input is 1 so put this is 0 1 it means 0 1 present state is is not having any transition when input is 1 okay and output is 0 so put the output is 0 okay here the input value when input value is 1 we you need to put the output when input value is 0 we you need to put the output now 0 1 is going this arrow going to 1 1 state when input is 0 so 0 1 is going 1 1 state when input is 0 okay input is 0 so 1 1 state now what is the output the output is also 0 so put the value 0 okay so this is finished now come to the 1 1 state so here is 1 1 state 1 1 state is having no transition okay when the input is 1 so it means no transition means same state so 1 1 so when input is 1 so 1 1 what is your output when input is 1 so output is 0 now 1 1 state is going to 1 0 state when input is 0 and output is also 0 so here 1 0 is your next state and output is again 0 now come to 1 0 state okay 1 0 state when input is 0 okay so there is no transition input is 0 there is no transition so put 1 0 and at this condition the output is also 0 when 1 0 input is 1 it is reaching to 1 0 0 sorry so it is reaching to 0 0 and output is 1 
okay so this is your transition state so if we talk about this whole diagram i can say um, 0 0 is having no transition for 0 okay and 1 0 1 0 state is having no transition for 0 input 0 1 and 1 1 is having transition when 0 is input okay and 0 1 and 1 1 is having no transition when the input is 1 1 the thing is first you have to remember this first first value in the arrow written input oblique output is written here okay so 0 0 no transition reaching to 0 0 when input is 0 okay then put the value 0 at the output so i hope you able to draw this table so let's take another example now this is the example draw the transition table for the following state diagram okay so here uh, uh, present states are like this a b c d so i will put the a b c d here okay I will put the A, B, C, D. So, A, B, and C, D. Okay. So, present state is A. Now, come to A. A is having no transition when input is 1. As I already told you, uh, when 1 by 0 means input by output. Okay. So, A is having no transition. So, put here A. Oh, sorry. Because 1. Input is 1. So, A. And output is 1. 0 so put 0 now a this is the outgoing 0 0 when a is having 0 as input it is going to b and the output is again 0 so put the value 0 now come to the b state okay now come to the b state so this is outgoing 0 so when input is 0 no no change means no transition and output is yeah, input is 0 so no transition and output is 0 okay now here 1 0 when input is 1 it is going to state C it is going to state C and the output is 0 now come to the C okay now come to the state C C C is having when C is 0 0 means input is 0 it is again going to be B okay and the output is 0 now when C is 1 it is going to D and output is 1 so C is 1 it is going to D and output is 1. Now come to your D state. So D when 0 0. Okay. So it is going to be. It is going to be and output is 0. Okay. And when 1 oblique 0 means input. When 1 input is there. 1 is input. So this is D is giving you A. Means it is going to A. Okay. And the output is 0 okay okay let's take an another example okay so again present state 0 0 1 1 1 0 1 1 okay so 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 i have followed the sequence it doesn't matter okay uh, in figure if the states are different and you are writing here differently uh, pre normally clockwise states are given but here i think clock in anti-clockwise states are given so no problem so present itself the values which are written inside this circle that is called present state 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 okay now let's start with one any one of the values okay so i'm starting with 0 0 so see 0 0 is going to 1 1 state when input is 0 and output is 0 okay so it is going to 1 1 state when input is 0 you can see input is 0 and output is 0 okay now this 0 0 you see this arrow this arrow is going to 0 1 when input is 1 so 0 1 and you see oblique 0 is written so output is 0 okay now come to this 1 1 state so 1 1 state is here I am following step by step so 1 1 step okay see here three arrows are incoming and two arrows are outgoing what it means any state okay can have either zero or one as input okay so it will always have two outgoing states okay but it can have incoming means what is it means it can be a next state for uh, many presented states okay past states you can also say so now come to the 0 1 or uh, sorry 1 1 I have taken 1 1 so this is the outgoing arrow and this is the outgoing so 0 0 you see 0 oblique 0 for 0 input it is going to 1 0 state so 1 0 and the output is also 0 okay this 1 1 
is going to 1 0 square state first one is 0 0 as input and output is 0 now 1 1 is again going to 1 0 state when when input is 1 and output is also 1 so it will go 1 0 and output is 1 okay now come to 1 0 state so here is your 1 0 state so see this 1 0 is having no transition for 0 input no transition means it will again means uh, for 1 0 state the next state will be 1 0 okay and the output will be 0 okay 1 0 1 0 so output will be 0 and this is outgoing so 1 by 1 means 1 input so for 1 input the next state is 1 1 means this arrow is going to next state is 1 1 and output is 1 so put the value is 1 now come to 1 0 okay sorry 0 1 so 0 1 for 0 0 you can see for 0 0 it is going 1 1 so 1 1 and the output is also 0 and 0 1 is going to 0 0 for 1 in when input is 1 so put the value 0 0 okay and the output is 0 so this is your uh, uh, means uh, to table for the this uh, state transition diagram so i hope you are getting all these questions so let's do it another another question one more question all these questions are for your practice purpose uh, you can practice it if you are not able to do it you can uh, go through this video now this is the transition table or transition diagram and we need to do the transition table again 0 0 1 0 1 1 0 1 sometimes q1 q2 q3 s1 s2 s3 s4 so these in the value inside the circle doesn't matter okay the value in outside the circle means uh, uh, within the arrows matter okay that that will tell you what will be the next state and what will be the output okay so let's start with 0 0 so you can again see 0 0 0 is having no transition for the value of 0 0 so we will put 0 0 no transition means it next state will be the same state and the output is 0 0 oblique 0 first 0 is telling you input value okay this this first zero will tell you what will be your next state and the next zero will tell you output value okay second zero will tell you now where is the uh, yeah here one one by zero so zero 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 is going to zero one okay zero zero is going to zero one when the input is one so it is going to zero one and output is zero okay one by zero now come to this one zero state okay i'm i'm following the sequence or let's go to this zero one state okay uh, we will follow the sequence of the table okay so zero one okay so zero one uh, you can see when input is zero the first zero input is zero it is going to zero zero state so let's go zero zero state and zero by zero oblique one so output will be one okay for one zero zero one state is going to one one so we will put the one one okay and the output is 1 oblique 0 so 0 will be your output very clearly i have written okay input value means when input is 0 what will be your next state when input is 1 what will be your next state for input 0 what is your output for input 1 what is your output okay now let's move to the 1 0 state okay so 1 0 again no transition for input 1 okay no transition for input 1 so let's go 1 0 and what is the output value is 0 now for 1 0 okay 0 oblique 1 means when input is 0 the output is 1 and 1 for input is 0 1 0 state is going to 0 0 so 0 0 okay and the output is 1 now 1 1 1 1 when input is 0 the output is 1 and the state next state is 0 0 so next state is 0 0 and input is 0 output is 1 put the value 1 now 1 0 okay 1 1 is going to 1 0 state and 1 1 state is going 1 0 state for input 1 so put the value 1 0 and the output is 0 okay so these are the some questions based on your state transition diagram 
okay in my previous video i already uh, given a video on how to draw a straight transition diagram by using the straight transition table so you can go through that one also so that you can do reverse type of questions so uh, these are the questions guys so so these are the question for your practice and you can uh, go through it you can easily able to learn how to draw this tra straight transition table so i hope guys you able to understand this one so please like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching